20 years to the day, 20 years since 13 souls were lost and the lives of countless others were forever changed. The worst day in Columbine High School history pushed that community closer together. Today, survivors and friends and family of those who died got together at a memorial in Clement Park. Nine News reporter Nelson Garcia was there covering the events. Moments of it were very uplifting, Nelson, and other moments were completely heartbreaking when you heard what some of the survivors had been through. Mark, in talking with victims and victims' families, this week leading up to this day has been very difficult. Culminating in this service at Clement Park adjacent to Columbine High School, the theme, remember, reflect, recommit, with an emphasis on making change. turning a day of pain into something else for Principal Frank DeAngelis. A time to remember, a time to hope. I spoke those words 19 years ago. Today is a day of recommitment. A renewed mission in the name of the victims of the Columbine shooting, like Lauren Townsend and her mother, Dawn Anna. Birthdays, anniversaries, graduations, weddings, births, they're all celebrated with a twinge of emptiness. An emptiness left when 12 students and one teacher were killed, impacting people and a president. And I'll never forget the determination you showed to somehow piece your lives back together. It's because of you. Sean Graves was shot six times in the back. Could somebody like me survive that day? He wants everyone here. To move past hate. With the media looking in, looking for us for answers, we led the way. We showed them that we can overcome evil. We can love one another. We can become family. They can become something more, according to Patrick Ireland, shot twice in the head. Hope. Memories. Recovery. Forgiveness. These are some of the words that come to mind when I think back on the past 20 years and what our journey has meant to me. Now they want this day to change from a day of mourning to a statewide day of service. Something wonderful from something so horrible. This is how we honor them. For years, Columbine students have been engaged in a day of service instead of going to school on April 20th. Now they want this to spread to other schools and other communities for people to commit to helping others on this day every year as a tribute to the 13 people who died 20 years ago today. Mark Ryan, this would be an evolution on a day that will be remembered moving forward in this fashion. I could still see the kid in, in uh, uh, Patrick Ireland and, and uh, Sean Graves. I, uh, their, their journeys, I, I had no idea, just mm -hmm. very difficult. It's been a struggle for everybody, for yeah. everyone, but most especially them. And they supported one another, and that's why they feel like they're stronger today, and, you know, they want to transform this day into something else, and, you know, they do it together. Special day for sure. All right, Nelson, thank you. You're welcome.